Hey, welcome back to Adam's Makerspace. Today I'm going to do a quick tutorial just to kind of show you how you can make images such as this dragon or one of these clerics, this little guy, a happy little ghost pirate, or Bigfoot using tools like ChatGPT, Remove.bg, and Windows Paint 3D. So to get started, what you're going to want to do is head on over to ChatGPT, chatgpt.com. And down here, you're going to want to type in a message. So what you're going to want to do is make sure you say, generate an image that can easily be cut on a silhouette Cameo 3. I want the image to be of whatever you want. So let's say a Jack Russell Terrier. Let's see what it gives us. Sometimes we need to have that adjust it. Sometimes we don't. Let's see what we get. Oh, that's a cute one. Uh, actually, I like how it is. So let's go ahead and get that. We'll just tap this little download button. And you're going to see it came up as a weird web P, web P file. Let's go ahead and open that. And then you can right click, save image as. Say Jack Russell. JPEG. Let's see but now that we have that, we will go ahead and open the folder that's in. And then you're going to go to this site, which is remove.bg. And then just drop it in here. And you'll see that it will magically remove all of the white space throughout the entire thing, making it clear. <clears throat> and when you're happy with that, you can just hit download. If you wanted to remove anything else, say it missed a spot. You would just tap the erase and do that, or if it removes something that wasn't supposed to be, just toggle it to restore and then you can put that back. But it did it perfectly fine for me, so I'm going to go ahead and hit download, and now that'll be downloaded. Open up Paint 3D, and you're going to browse to that folder. Grab the this one, the Remove BG Preview, which is the one that has no background on it. And you can zoom in and see if there's any finishing touches you need, any edge lines you need to clean up. Sometimes ChatGPT makes some weird, weird, weird marks in weird places. Um, but this lets you get in here. You can just touch them up. If you just tap the little erase button here, you'll just remove it so that you won't see it anymore. Um, but that's really all there is to it. And then once you have what you want, pop open Silhouette Studio or whatever program you're using. Toss it in. And then you're ready to cut. Um, that's all there is to it. It's really easy. And ChatGPT, I think, will generate three files, three images per day, unless you get their plus. And then I don't know how many you get because I just used the free version. But easy to do. If this tutorial helped you, make sure you tap that like button, subscribe to this channel so you don't miss new content. And as always, I hope you have a great day.